As we mentioned earlier, Blaine County has been hit hard by the coronavirus, the most cases in the state, but why? And what's being done to curb the outbreak? Joining us now live is Dr. Joshua Kern, Vice President of Medical Affairs for St. Luke's Hospital at Wood River, Jerome and Twin Falls. Uh, doctor, thank you so much for joining us. I think it's great. The more we can talk about this and get the word out, the better we'll be somewhere down the road, hopefully sooner than later. So let's t talk about those numbers. Why so many in the Valley? Yeah, I think, uh, you know, the speculation is that uh, it was brought in from people coming back to either vacation homes or trying to escape some of the places uh, where the COVID had already uh, taken hold. Uh, that's all speculation. We don't know that for sure. But then uh, likely it's spread in the community and we're just seeing that that's the first community to get, uh, you know, widespread community spreading. Sure. What are your concerns up in the Wood River and what are your priorities in trying to bring those numbers down? Yeah, I mean, social isolation is the key, keeping it from spreading. If you show any symptoms uh, and really if you're not showing symptoms, we need to be staying apart from people, especially in the Wood River Valley where we know it, it has already been spreading. Doctor, do people need to take this virus more seriously in how they live their everyday lives? Yeah, this is an unprecedented event in the, 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 in the history of the world that I've uh, lived in. And um, if you look at the experience that you've had in places like Wuhan, where it started, or northern Italy, where their uh, health systems were completely overrun, the outcomes were very bad. We're hoping to slow uh, the spread and slow and kind of what we call uh, bend the curve to uh, prevent our healthcare systems from getting overwhelmed. And we got kind of a preview of that in how quickly um, both uh, providers and uh, workers at the, the hospital in Wood River got exposed and uh, had to go into quarantine themselves, uh, which is why we ended up closing the hospital up there to uh, inpatient work. Okay, last question for you, doctor. Uh, quickly, how is the medical staff holding up? Yeah, I, I, honestly, I couldn't be more proud of the everybody that works for St. Luke's right now. Everyone has pulled together, uh, ha, has stayed really positive, although the, the pressure has been high as we've been getting ready for this. Um, I've, I've never seen uh, people more willing to step forward, and I couldn't be more proud of our providers. Fantastic. Dr. Joshua Kern, thanks so much for joining us, and uh, we may uh, talk to you down the road. Yep. Thank you. Take care.